Have you seen my Easter decor feature on the latest Us Weekly magazines out on newsstands now? If you haven't, check this out. This is the photo shoot that we're doing for Us Weekly. Uh, they asked us to give you guys trending tips for Easter. And of course, they tapped me on the shoulder because you know they wanted it girly by. I'm sitting here with Chef Aaron and we are here at Kilted Group doing what we do best and we are creating an amazing photo op for you guys to give you amazing ideas for Easter or whatever holiday you celebrate. What we thought we would do for this particular shoot is that we wouldn't do the typical pastel colors. It's so passe in a sense and honestly most people will come to your house dressed in pink, purple, lavender, lilac, the whole thing. So we wanted to neutralize the table and create a bold statement with blue and white. We thought that chinoiserie, which is a type of decor, um, French based with an Asian twist and create a beautiful monochromatic tablescape of such nature. So this was the inspiration for what we came up with for Easter design and inspo for Us Weekly magazine. It was all about the chinoiserie with the blue and white. Um, very French with a twist of the chinoiserie elements. And then we wanted to create a lot of texture by creating some gold leaf eggs on top of the table with beautiful flower and color blocking elements. So each flower bloom is featured in its own vase, in its own color, creating this amazing monochromatic tone on the table. Um, we wanted to stick with gold to match the gold leaf eggs and um, really make it opulent yet approachable. We're not mixing flowers here. There's not a mix of flowers. This is all one type of flower, one type of flower, one type of flower. That's called flower blocking. Even with color, color blocking, color blocking. And the impact is higher versus mixing them all together and creating a messy visual. So this is definitely the way to go sometimes. Less is more. Keep it simple. Manolo Doreste. He's been top photographer in Miami and the world beyond for many years. I've known this man for many years. He actually shot me nude. He did a boudoir with me for Russell. This was like how many years ago? It's been like maybe don't say. Maybe maybe 15 years ago. It was a, no, it was more. Before I had kids. <laughs> how was that body though? Body yadi yadi. Thank you very much. <laughs> here is to try to give variety of the tablescape right now this looks very formal because there's a lot of gold especially with the gold bottom charger this is definitely more daytime friendly matching these chairs and also this beautiful backdrop here so I think we're gonna play around with the place setting and see what works best to give you guys a day look and a night look okay. Easter should be a holiday where everyone gets together and feel as if they are at home so definitely make sure that your tablescape is unique, however, approachable and comfortable. One piece of life advice is that whatever you do, do it with people you love. It makes the day so much better. And one more note is that having no ego is truly the key in team playing. Right now, we decided to create a day look, switched up the charger plates to the bamboo one that I just showed you, added a floral bloom at each place setting and switching out the napkins to a yellow variety color so that it brings a daylight look to the entire tablescape. Our minds are usually so trained to dress in pastel and decorate in pastel for Easter. Why not break that trend and create something so timeless and unique? Because you guys are gonna probably come in pastels anyway. Don't worry, I've placed links to all of these shoppable items or like items in my LTK page. Be sure to follow me and also click on all of the items to try to replicate this entire look.